All right, guys, it's a Tuesday. I don't know if you can hear that, but it's the sound of children. <laughs> if you're coming here to teach, you should become very familiar with that sound. There's a school right here. If you looked at my last video, you'll see the long tuk-tuk ride. I only uploaded it because it was going to be part of my of the video before that, because it was filmed on the same day. But uh, I didn't want to make a 40-minute long video. So if you get annoyed by the sound of my voice, and I understand why you would. Uh, take a look at that one. It's just uh, got some music playing over it. And it's just a very long tuk-tuk ride. All around different parts of Siem Reap. Some areas you probably haven't seen on this channel before because I've never been out there walking. Yeah. Very wet over here. Very wet. It hasn't rained, but people spray out there, spray out the dust from the road. And of course, it makes puddles. We're on our way to a uh, market. But we uh, decided to go this way first. Go look at another, another building. Hey, puppy! It's been puppy season. That's the third small puppy I've seen in the last few days at different places. Oh, I forgot it. Oh no, I did. I forgot it. Yep, I went and forgot my coffee. Oh. So disappointed in myself. But this is on the uh, side of Watbo. Little dirt road here. We've been down here before. Hey, good news uh, about my channel. Today, I just got the certificate that I hit, uh, or the milestone. That you get sent from a tube buddy if you use that extension for your YouTube channel. Uh, that I hit a hundred thousand views, which is awesome. 315 videos, 100,000 views. So you guys did that, and I thank you all for watching. Um, also, looking at my stats, I have gained 55. 55 new subscribers in the last 28 days <clears throat> so that is pretty awesome I don't know what I'm gonna do for my big 1,000 1, 1,000th subscriber video I, I still got time to think about it sounds like there's gonna be a great influx of people <clears throat> but one thing I will do is I'll make a video and I'll tell you some things about myself that uh Nobody else knows. That's right, nobody. Well, there's there's a couple things people that know me from my past would know. But there's also something that I've never told anyone, not even my closest friends or family back home. And I will reveal that at 1,000 subscribers. <clears throat> it's no deep, dark secret. It's just something I had... Uh, wanted to do before I even came to Cambodia let me hold that thought oh she wants to look at this place right here okay not the phone number okay she wants me to take a picture of the phone number 
So there it is. Okay, it looks, see if I can, hmm. Can't really see in there, but it looks like a house. <coughs> then she wants us, of course, set up her business outside. I'm pretty sure that's going to be kind of pricey. But we shall see. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. No? Very untrusting. I would have petted your head. Anyway. As I was saying, there was something before I even left for Cambodia that I had, uh, I wanted to do. But I never told anybody because it's one of those things you tell people and they know you and your lifestyle. And they go, yeah, right, like that's ever going to happen. Like you're ever going to do that. You know, one of those kind of things. So you don't say anything. I watched a ton of videos about it uh, back in 2016 and part of 2017. And I was like, this is something cool. This is something I want to do. Uh, something that would require me to quit my job anyway. And it would take about six to seven months to actually do it. And you... There's no way to make money while you're doing this thing. I just want you to know that. So I'm giving you some hints. Uh, but even after I had saved enough money and I knew I was, I had enough to move here, I did think for a while maybe I should just take this money because it does require a certain amount of money also, about ten to twelve thousand dollars. Although some people have done this for, you know, half of that, but it's always better to be prepared, right? Um, but it's, so I was thinking about taking that money and thinking if I could do this, I could just wait another two years before I moved to Cambodia. I could get this done, take seven months to do this. And after that's done, come back, get another job, wait, you know, save all my money for another year and have enough saved up to then move to Cambodia. But in the end, I decided it was just time to move. And uh, so I used the money instead to move here. But it's something I've always, I wanted to do for a long time. And I'm going to reveal what that is. And how I might still be able to do it. Although my time is running out. I'm not a young man anymore. And I would like to do it be, before I'm, you know, too old. And yes, I know that would mean I would have to... Leave Cambodia for a year or a little bit more in order to get this done because it is in the United States. But I would still like to do it if I can. And then, of course, move back here. That's right, the big reveal at 1,000 subscribers. So be sure to tell all your friends and family to subscribe and watch the videos so that was good news about my youtube channel i woke up to that that's always nice to see i never keep track of anything like uh you know subscribers or uh views or likes or anything like that but since i integrated uh two buddy and actually figured out how to use all their tools for that kind of thing it's really really easy to figure out get a page you can look at any of your stats yeah. she got waffles waffles these are actually um made they look like waffles but they're actually made out of rice rice coconut coconut and yeah. rice, coconut, and sugar? Yeah. Rice, coconut, and sugar. So they're like rice wobbles. Very tasty though. Not too sweet, very tasty.
Sátya. Sátya. Say hello. Yes, hello. <laughs> Eat your waffle. Yeah, so anyway, once I learned how to use TubeBuddy, it's a really good, to good tool. I like it because uh, you can get all the stats for not only your channel when you're watching a video, but also anybody else's video you're watching. You can see how many subscribers they have, how many views overall they have, how many comments, likes, and dislikes on that particular video. So you can keep track of yourself and your competition at the same time. So it's a pretty handy tool and it's free. It's a Google Chrome extension. Check it out if you haven't. Ooh, Jeremy and Claire. Uh, their channel, their YouTube channel is uh, linked down below in the description. They're finally back in Siem Reap. They just got in uh, last night, I believe. This is Tuesday, I believe it was Monday night. And uh, they'll be putting out some content, so be sure to subscribe to their channel and see what they're doing today. I guess they were out looking for a house. They found a couple of possibilities, so we'll see how that goes. I'm sure they'll tell you all about it. But now that they're here, Oh man, these dogs are having a fit. Look at that one thinking he's all bad. He's just gonna walk his little bull leg itself over there and bend off the bigger animals. I mean, he looks like a tough guy. But yeah, subscribe to their channel for updates. And uh, show them some love because they're gonna be putting out some good content. Also, we got almost all the band together here. There are people still coming. Uh, one of my subscribers is going to be here on the 7th. Which is Saturday, I believe. I believe it's Saturday. Uh, and then we can have a party. Anybody who listens to this video and anybody who hears this video, plus people who don't maybe watch all my videos, I'll be sure to send you an invitation if I know you. We're going to get together and get everybody together and have a party but of course it's never really a party until stitcher gary is here and i'm not sure what his timetable is i believe he won't be here until next year if i remember correctly but we'll just have to have another one when he gets here because it's just not the same without you gary So that's what's going on. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I get a whole waffle to myself. Ooh. Nice, hot, fresh. Mm. Mm. Mm, that's a good waffle. All right, how much for one? One. One. Okay. Five hundred real for one, which is about twelve cents. <laughs> it's a nice tasty treat for a little over a dime. So, of course, I'll keep you updated. I know, don't talk with your mouthful. It's disgusting. But I'm hungry. <clears throat> anyway, I will keep you updated on that health back there. Something like you can call and find out all the information. And, uh... Be ready for that big reveal at 1,000 subscribers. I'll also do something else, by the way. When I hit 1,000, something special. I don't know what. I'm open to suggestions. 
So leave them in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe as well if you want if you want to see more of my videos. If you do not, I don't hold it hold it against you, it's okay. No hard feelings. Also down below are all my links. In case you don't know, I have a site called Road to 1000. And my goal is to raise $1,000 a month in donations. Not just for my sparkling personality or to support my channel. But so that I can teach locals here. And not charge them anything. All the people I teach right now. I don't get paid from them at all. Because people donate money every month. So I can offer my services for free. And that is really awesome. That kind of giving you don't see a lot. And I always appreciate it. And we've had... Uh, last month was pretty good. But I think this month we can have our best month yet at $300. My goal right now, as I always say, is to get up to at least a monthly donation amount of half of my goal, which is $500, would be half each month, because we do have students who want to join, but of course, they're still waiting for people to donate so we have enough money to get them sponsored. That's okay, it'll happen. Like I keep telling them, it'll happen. Just be patient. But I think if we can have a $300 month, we might be able to add a couple more. Well, we will be able to add at least two more. And that will be very, very awesome. So if you want to donate, there is a link down below. You can also visit my blog about it at Road to 1000 website, which is also below. And if you want to buy my book, Live in Cambodia, a guide for living in the kingdom of wonder. There's a link down below where that book is hosted. It's an instant download. And all the proceeds from there will also go into my one-time education fund. And I have a new book coming out. That's going along great. Getting a lot of writing done. It's already longer than my last book. It's a big... It's a big book of weird top ten lists. And it's going to cover many, many topics. Like, a lot of topics. I'm going to give you ten weird, amazing, awesome, or disgusting facts about those topics. And underneath each individual... Uh topic and each individual entry under each topic is going to be my synopsis of that fact and also each one will have its own individual link to a page where you can get even more information and get the whole story about that particular fact so you can go down your own rabbit hole if you want <laughs> of the things you find interesting. So be on the lookout for that. I'll do it the same way I did my Living Cambodia book. As soon as it's almost complete, I'll have a two week pre-order period for everybody who follows me and watches me on social media, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and all those links are down below as well. So you guys will be able to pre-order first and have it sent to your inbox on day one. Then after I get all the pre-orders, I'll put it up for sale to the general public, like my other book. Anyway, all those links I just yammered on about are in the description. Along with links to other YouTube channels you might enjoy, if you enjoy this one. And as I said, all my social media. Alright. 
guess we're headed down to the old market. Ooh, it's getting pretty toasty out here, but I do have a new shirt. I don't normally buy clothes because I already have clothes. But saying lie. Saying we were in that shop around the corner from our house, everything's no more than ten thousand real, you know, two dollars and fifty cents. And so she saw she saw this shirt. And she was looking at it, holding it up to me, and I said, no, I don't need a shirt. I got t-shirts. Why do I need to spend money on another shirt? But she was like, oh, she gave me one of those looks like, oh, men. <laughs> so she bought it for me. It's pretty nice. Let's see if I can get a picture of this. Oh, nope, it won't let me switch between this view and the front view. Let me see if I can do this. I don't know how well you saw that because I just turned the camera around. But anyway, it's a nice shirt for $2.50. And okay, this is getting overly long and I really have nothing more to say. So, I think I was in the middle of saying something and then I digressed and now I cannot remember what I was saying right before I crossed the street. Oh yes, I was going to say it is getting, it is pretty hot out here. So I'm glad I got this shirt because it is breathable and it wicks away some of the moisture. So it's very comfortable. All right. I'll talk to you guys in the next one.